for 25 years he's been living La Vida Loca, but now Ricky Martin is spreading his wings and going toe-to-toe -to -toe with some comedy greats. Ricky has taken a starring role in the new Apple TV Plus series Palm Royale, which follows an ambitious woman in 1969 as she battles to secure a seat at America's most exclusive table. It premieres exclusively on Apple TV Plus today and I caught up with him for an exclusive chat all about it. So you're planning on staying for the season? Hello, Ricky Martin. It's so nice to talk to you. It's so, so nice to talk to you too. How are you? Thank you for your time. I'm bloody good now that I'm having a chat to you, mate. How are you? Same here, love. Same here. First month's a trial. Chance for everyone to look you over to see if you fit in. Then you need two sponsors to make it official. Congratulations on the show. It's so, like, rich and immersive. Thank you. Yes. Exactly. It's music to my ears. Let's talk about the stars in it. Let's talk about the fact that I'm able to be in front of the camera with Carol Burnett and Laura Dern and Kristen Wiig. Hello, the one and only. And Alice and Jenny. I mean, it, we can go on and on and on. For me, it was very important to to do comedy, something that I've never done in the past. And, you know, these ladies, they held my hand and they brought me to this wonderful universe of, of comedy and parody. And, and I felt really comfortable. I think I liked it too much. Robert, shake me another martini and then let's play doctor. Obviously, the story is wonderful because we talk about some issues, right? Issues that, you know, men felt back in the 60s, but they're kind of relevant. We still feel them today. So to talk about it with a, with a little bit of sense of humor and, and joy, it's to bring darkness and comedy and drama all and shake it up in one, it's, it's been a lot of fun. They do say that comedy is the hardest to do. Do you reckon that's true? I think it's true. It's about living the moment. It's about being present at all times. Comedy is very difficult to write. So it's wonderful to hear action and understand that between action and cut, anything can happen. And that's what I learned in this. I, my favorite exercise was to leave my script in my dressing room and not bring it anywhere, anywhere near the set. Um, I knew the story. I knew the message that we needed to leave in front of the camera. But to get there, you can do whatever you want. That's how free we felt. And so you're doing this, though, with some of, like, the best of the best. Do you get they nervous when best. you go into that sort of situation? No, I get nervous. I, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I, I mean, I'm made of emotions. Give me a break. Yes, of course I get <laughs> But I like being nervous. It, it, I like it. It makes me feel alive. But yes, I was nervous. I'm still nervous. I love being outside of my comfort zone. When the outside of my comfort zone becomes my comfort zone, I look for something else that can challenge me in and just throw me into the lions. I really love it. The Palm Royale, the most exclusive club in the world, was where I belonged. So what is more nerve wracking then? You walking out into like an arena or a stadium or whatever about to perform or walking onto set and doing something that you've never done before? I still get nervous when I walk on stage in front of 25,000 people or 30,000 people. You know, when the lights go down in an arena, and you hear the, the roar of the audience. <sighs> that I'm addicted to. I'm always gonna be making music. I'm always gonna go on the road. The immediate reaction of the crowd is something that I, that I love, that I've been feeling since I'm tw 12 years old. It's part of me, but this other monster, this other way of, of storytelling, it's also fascinating and it moves me in a really phenomenal way. And I feel like this is a very beautiful new cycle in, in my life that, uh, that it, it feels like, like, like rocket fuel. So let's see what happens. Let's see. Let's hear it for Palm Beach! Oh, gee, it looks good, doesn't it? What, the film or <laughs> oh, Ricky? Gee, he is a beautiful guy, isn't he? He is. How's the accent? I love it. Hola. 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 <laughs> Hey there, Today fans, Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh my God. <laughs> Carl. Hey, thanks for watching our <laughs> YouTube channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. that never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about? <laughs>